In this video, just find duplicates in a table. For that, let us create a table. So, the syntax will be create table SQL basic is the database name, dot dbo is the schema name, dot duplicates is the table name. ID is the field which is of integer type and it can take null values. First name is the field which is where care data type and has got 25 bytes and it can take uh, null values. Last name is where care of 25 and it can take null values. So let us create this table. Here we have this SQL basics database and in this tables if I right click and refresh the duplicates table has been created if i expand this columns id which is of integer data type first name is where care data type and last name is where care data type now let us insert some values into this table so we want to find the duplicates in a table let us enter the duplicate value so the syntax would be insert into SQL basics dot dbo dot duplicates values. The ID is one. The first name is James, and last name is Smith. So this is the syntax for this. Insert into the table name is SQL basics dot dbo dot duplicates, and the what values we are entering? ID one. First name James and last name Smith. So this record I am entering three times so that this will create a duplicate record. And the next record would be two David Warner and three Karen Joe. So let us insert all these records into this table. If I execute this, the five rows have been affected. That means they have been inserted. Now let us see what is there in this table. So that I use select star from SQL basics dot dbo dot duplicates. Execute. See all these records have been inserted into the table, and these three are uh, the duplicates. First three records are the duplicates. So now we want to find these uh, duplicates in the table. So how do you find the duplicates in the table? For that we can use group by and having clauses. So select, we are selecting, there are ID, first name and last name in this table. So Select ID, first name, last name, and then count of star. We are counting the number of uh, duplicates. So count of star from SQL basics .dbo duplicates table. Here we are group by. We are using group by. So group by ID, first name, last name. So if you group by ID, first name, and last name so this whole group will be considered as one group and uh, you can count how many this count will give you how many are there for that group so id first name last name if you consider as one group and uh, if you you are, for, you are counting the number of uh, records then you get the number of records for the same group and having count of star greater than one so if there is only one record then you will get only one as count of star but if you have this this group has got uh, three records then you will get, get the count of star as three so if count of star is having count of star greater than one then it's a duplicate so if i execute this 
three one James Smith repeated three times. That's how you can find out the duplicates. And let me execute that uh, select star from and these these are all the records. There is another way we can find a duplicate. So finding duplicates using Windows function. So now select. ID from our first name first name from here basics dot apo dot duplicates so after the last name we'll have pro underscore number then the over clause partition by id first name and last name Then ordered by ID as pronoun. So this is the Windows function we are using with pro underscore number, open braces, close braces, over clause. So we are partitioning by ID, first name and last name and ordering by ID. So here in the PS case, we are grouping by ID, first name, last name. So here we are partitioning by ID, first name, last name. And by selected I got uh, James Smith, row number one, two, three, David Warner one, Karen Jones one. So if the row number is greater than one, then is a duplicate. So find that out. We can take this part in a CTE. With CTE now we can say select star from CTE with CTE dot So num greater than one. If I select this now, see one James Smith row num two, one James Smith row num three. So these two are duplicate. You can just delete these two using delete from ct. The ct dot row num is greater than one.
So let us check the records which has this records. We have selected this. So instead of selecting them, and after delete. Now, if we want to find out the even numbered rows, what are the even number rows? Two and um, uh, two is the even number ID. We have to consider the ID. So two is the even numbered row. So for that, the what we do is in the where class we say ID mod percentage uh, means it is a modulus sign. So it's a mathematical uh, um, in operator where uh, modulus means if you divide id by 2 uh, actually modulus is uh, not division it is like it will it will give you the remainder so if we divide id by 2 id mod 2 means what what is the remainder remainder id mod 2 will give you the remainder if it is 0 then it's an even number so if I say select star from SQL basics or DBO or duplicates where ID mod 2 is equal to 0. So if you say divide 2 by 2, what will be the remainder? Remainder is 0. So ID mod 2 is 0, then it is an even number. If you want to find the odd numbers, then ID mod 2 should be 1. So if I say select star from SQL basics where id mod 2 is equal to 1 so we got id 1 and id 3 so that's how we can find out even numbered rows and odd numbered rows if you like the video please subscribe by clicking on the subscribe button for notifications on upcoming videos please click on the bell icon